This is Raymond for Vaping 360, hanging out with Jake from Vapor Hub, who's going to tell you all about the new line of juice called Binary. What is the concept behind Binary? Well, I think it starts with the ones and zeros. Binary is a, a very complex, but yet simple in nature. Um, what we tried to do was really get down to the ones and zeros of, of juice making. So each flavor actually is a different VGPG mix uh, because every extract acts differently with the VGPG. So we wanted to make sure that we got the most flavor um, as well as the, the, the intenseness of both uh, before and after the inhale exhale. Now let's talk about three flavors in particular. Uh, the one that caught my eye was Bite. Bite is our take on a cereal flavor. Rather than just being one type of cereal, we kind of mixed a couple cereal flavors, being the, the Fruit Circles and the Captain Crunch. We made it very subtle as opposed to overbearing, so it is a great for all day, every day. We've gotten great success in that specific flavor, and uh, we're very confident that if you try it, you're gonna love it. Now, you were telling me before that Array is your most complex flavor. Yeah, it actually was a happy accident. Um, you know, we've been we've been doing this for a long time, and um, so what happened was we took two of our most popular juice uh, juices and mixed those together to create this masterpiece. People compare it to a Sour Patch Kid. To say and and to take that fame and say well, we came up with this masterful flavor would be an understatement because it was actually our employees that came up with this this uh, unique mixture. So it has your sweets and your sour. It's just really different than everything else out there. Now let's round things out with POW. POW is the all day, every day. It's a, it's a pomegranate with a sweet watermelon, and then it has a slight touch of marshmallow. What marshmallow does, it really gives it the sweetness and the smoothness um, to, to round out both really the pomegranate, because that's a tough extract to work with. As you were saying before, you've been in this business for a long time, yeah. and if you're not familiar with the Vapor Hub brand, these guys have been around. They've been doing it longer than practically anyone. So safety is a big concern for you guys. Can you tell me about the lab conditions and the testing you guys do? Absolutely. So what we did when we came out with this line is we wanted to make sure it was in an ISO uh, 7 or above GMP and we wanted to make sure that we tested for diacetyl. We didn't want to react to it. We wanted to be proactive. We have the diacetyl safe reports out to the public for public uh, view have the liability insurance and uh, and really just, just doing things the right way. Now you were trying to tell me the difference between diacetyl safe and diacetyl free, which some people use. Can you explain to the audience what that is? Yeah, so for marketing purposes, you you see both, uh, you see a lot of diacetyl free. Um, now, with that being said, you can't really say that. Um, truthfully because you're not testing down to zero parts per million. Now in the UK, and the, they, they have a new uh, TBD law coming out, and that, that law is basically stating uh, that you need under 20 parts per million uh, for, um, for diacetyl, okay? Now what we did was we said, okay, we got the 20 parts per million, then we went down to the 10 parts per million, then we went down to the five parts per million, um, and that's pretty much the lowest that we could test right now, and uh, and we were we were safe all the way through. Now, I don't want to make the statement that we're diastol free because we can't even test for it right now. That kind of testing sounds really expensive. Yeah, I mean it's 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 part of business. It's the cost of doing business in the, in this in this growing industry. Again, you know, making sure that that our customers and down to you know our friends and family, we want to make sure that that they're vaping something that uh, that we can put our put our hand behind. These juices look great. I'm going to go try some out now, but I love the safety features that you guys have built into the line. If you want to learn more about the binary e-liquids, go to the Vapor Hub website and for the best vaping reviews, guides and features, go to Vaping 360, the home of vaping.